Hey, welcome back to the channel. Today I want to show you a really cool base effect rack that you can use for basically anything to make it go from something pretty boring to something pretty interesting. So without any further ado, let's go right into it. So I'm just in a blank template here just to show that this can basically work on anything. So the main thing is let's go ahead and open up a serum. And then of course, everybody knows OTT basically is downward and upward compression and makes a sound sound pretty level throughout all of its frequency range. I can turn a saw wave from this to this just makes it all pretty even. Now let's go ahead and start designing something here within Serum. Something pretty simple, maybe let's go into here. Maybe something like that. Let's do a warp mode here. And then maybe we just add some FM for some like high end character maybe a filter i've been really liking the uh, phaser ones something like that's kind of cool and then let's go and use another filter just to clean up the sound And then let's get some noise in here too, just to make the high end sound a little bit better. And then we'll have that go in there as well. Let's shout out our shape. And that's pretty cool. So I had the OTT on the entire time there. Here's without it. Here's with it. Now that is a pretty cool sound as it is, but what you can do and actually what I've been discovering here is this program called Crispy Clip. Now this is by Yum Audio um, and this is a really cool distortion plugin. It's similar to like Saturator. It's almost like a Saturator and like Camel Crusher combined. So you get some really cool effects out of this. So even if we just turn the OTT off, we'll put the Saturator at the end because that's just for soft clipping. Um, here's without anything on it. And we can start pushing this so you can actually see what the diagram is doing here. So you can get a pretty crispy sound there without doing too much. So, so using this and OTT, you can get some pretty cool effects out of it. So without any uh, effects on the serum preset and with the effects. So that's with like a developed serum preset. What if we just did something pretty simple? So let's go into splice here. Um, let's grab some type of like little bass sample here. So maybe something that's not too complex. Something like that is perfect. Now, what if we did it on here? So again, you just heard what it sounded like without it, but just so you hear it again, that's without any effects and with effects. A huge difference and now you could probably go in here let's say i wanted to have a serum trigger this and then maybe we wanted to write some type of pattern so let's go ahead and drag that here and then write a pattern really quick so our pattern sounds like this without effects on it and with effects stack ott stack it with crispy clip if you don't have crispy clip use something like saturator and camel crusher camel crusher is free or if you want to get crispy clip i have a code from yum audio that you can use to pick up the program to get 15 percent off but this is definitely a really worthwhile stack to use especially if you're trying to turn something that sounds pretty bleh out of splice into something that's pretty usable without doing too much to it so i hope you learned something from today's video that's all i have for you today thank you for watching and we will see you again in the next one